review. Um, and again, we'll have a link in the show notes for Pluggable Technologies and Edjack in the back, this uh, RJ45 connector. Um, <clears throat> that is probably the only thing it didn't. Hey guys, welcome to another video. In this video, we're going to be taking a look at a docking station from Pluggable Technologies. And uh, this is a really cool docking station, especially if you have Windows tablets. Um, very, very cool stuff for tablets. And uh, in stat fact, stay tuned. We're going to have an upcoming video uh, demoing this with an HP Stream 7. Um, and uh, it makes some amazing improvements to tablets. And especially when this was produced and kickstarted, it was being produced for the Dell Venue 8 Pro, which, um, like a lot of these tablets, is uh, they come with a USB. Um, basically a USB port that's used for OTG and charging and you can't do both you are strictly limited to hey if I want to use peripherals with my tablet I'm not gonna be able to charge it so I got limited time this solves that and this would include like the Dell Venue 8 the HP Stream 7 and a couple other tablets that are out there that are like that uh, so let's go ahead and take a look at the box as you can see is connect a Windows tablet to a monitor keyboard mouse network and other devices you can have multiple monitors so if I took my uh, Windows tablet plugged into this, it could go across two different screens. Now, I'm going to be kind of limited to uh, the display resolution that, um, you know, around my monitors and also that my, my tablet would support, but it should be decent enough. Um, so, you can see here with charging for tablets like the Dell Venue 8 Pro, that's kind of what they're pimping with this. Let's go ahead and flip it over. And you can see USB 2.0 devices and actually probably. Uh, 3.0 if you had an adapter or something, um, but camera, printer, keyboard, mouse, uh, earphones, mic, uh, digital video, USB enclosures, which you could put like drives in, uh, give it hardwired ethernet, which a lot of these tablets you can't, you basically have to use Wi-Fi, that'll solve that, and actually to a DVI, VGA, or HDMI monitor, and of course the Windows tablet is not included in the box, but uh, let's go ahead and see what is. So let's open this up. And I want to uh, definitely give a shout out to Pluggable Technologies for uh, uh, sending this to the show to review. Um, and again, we'll have a link in the show notes for Pluggable Technologies where you can pick one of these up. And uh, as you can see, here is the actual Pro 8 docking station itself. A lot of stuff on the side here. You've got USB ports, wired Ethernet, a DVI port. Uh, USB port and the power for the actual dock itself just a little base stand and then on the front you get two more USB ports headphones and microphone where you can plug in and some little vents up top here uh, so that's basically the dock itself now inside the box <clears throat> you get a whole bunch of stuff you get your USB cable you get in a uh, VGA to DVI adapter it looks like so that's very cool and if you want to flip that around, this looks like this is an HDMI to DVI adapter. Uh, you get your power, and uh, it's a universal power. It looks like uh, you can change it out, but the only one you get is the US version of the uh, outlet here. So you can actually plug this in and uh, be good to go. But it is interchangeable. That's very nice. So if you have uh, use for this in a different country than the United States, you can change that out. Then you get, uh, it looks like a micro USB to micro USB, and that is going to be more or less for what you use to plug in your, your tablet to the actual dock. And then you get a very nice weighted uh, base stand here, so that's very, it's actually very heavy um, metal uh, stand here with uh, four nice little rubber gripper feet, um, so that's very, very cool. And uh, that's all you get in the box, which is actually quite a lot. Um, so let's go ahead and plug this in. And as you can see, we'll just go ahead and mount that like so. And this is basically how the dock is going to look. And again, you're going to use all these peripheral little attachments here to fit the bill on what you need to plug this into a monitor. Um, now you don't get an Ethernet cable, you're going to have to get that uh, supplied for yourself if you want to actually use the Ethernet jack in the back, this uh, RJ45 connector. Um, <clears throat> that is probably the only thing it did not come with that uh, you would want to utilize out of the box uh, to uh, 
actually hardwire a device instead of use Wi-Fi. Um, other than that, uh, you know, you're good to go. And uh, if you want to check back, um, I'm not going to do a video of this in action until we actually do it with our Stream 7 tablet that we've got. So check the future video um, and you'll see this baby in action. And what we're going to do is we're going to hook a Stream 7 uh, HP Stream 7 tablet, which is a 7 inch full blown Windows tablet, up to this and we're going to hook it up to a screen, a keyboard, a mouse, and who knows what all else we might just uh, jack it into. And uh, definitely we're going to add uh, hardwired Ethernet to the HP Stream 7, so we have that as well. Uh, very cool stuff. So uh, definitely check the next video out for this uh, Pro 8 docking station here because we're going to put it through its tests and uh, show you what it can do. So anyway guys, that is the uh, Pro 8 docking station from Pluggable. Check the uh, show notes for more information about it or some more detailed specs. Uh, again, a link to where you can pick this up. And uh, definitely uh, worthwhile if you have any kind of tablet that you want to utilize in a more of a kind of a PC based, workstation based uh, uh, setup for your desktop. Again, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up and a subscription to the channel. And as always, guys, thanks for watching. Have a good one.